celebrating the best in our business. We're delighted to be supporting these important industry awards once again this year. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. The British Travel Awards, in association with Lloyd's TSP Cardnet, is the culmination of a full year of planning, steering committee meetings, nominations, voting, panel adjudications, and an extensive campaign to increase awareness via our various media partners and sponsors. All of this goes to ensure that the winners of tonight's categories can display their winner logos in the knowledge that this actually means something to customers. Good evening everyone. Travel Mall has been involved with the British Travel Awards from the beginning three years ago and we were happy to continue this partnership again this year to encourage trade participation starting with the calls in nomination way back in April. Throughout the year we have produced updates and news stories on how the awards have evolved and these have been distributed to our UK industry subscribers. We also have a Travel World TV crew here tonight to cover the awards and to talk to some of the winners and sponsors. The highlights of tonight's event, along with the list of winners, will be shown on the Travel World website. But the overall winner is... Haven Holiday. Please would Alan Lambert join me now to collect the award for Haven Holidays. I'm here with Debbie Goffin, who is a winner, or her company, of the Small Tour Operator of the Year Award, Premier Holidays. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Um, we're a privately owned company. We've been operating for over 70 years. Um, we wow. sell holidays to all our um, faraway destinations, um, America and Canada, um, and also Channel Islands and Isle of Man. Lisa McCauley is representing the winner for the best, uh, the car hire company of the year, Avis. Congratulations, yeah. Avis. Thank you very, very much. Well, you know, the UK is probably the biggest outbound um, market in Europe. More, more travelers um, out of, of, of the UK. And, you know, we, we have a fair proportion of that. So, yeah, it's fantastic. Uh, we have Tom Allen here, who is with Cadogan Holidays, winner this year of best tour operator to Western Mediterranean. Yes. We've had to change our formula. Um, we are a sister company of what was GB Airways who were sold to EasyJet 12 months ago. So the last 12 months has been a 12 months of change for us. We've been working very hard and we're absolutely delighted to win this award. I'm with Joe Jamowska and she represents Royal Caribbean Cruise Line, which is this year's winner of Cruise Line of the Year. I think the key thing is that Royal Caribbean International, we're always coming up with new ideas, new innovations on board our cruise ships. From ice skating, to flow riding, to rock climbing, who'd have thought you could do that at sea? We're really bringing a new meaning to cruising. The best activity sports holiday operator, uh, Crystal Holidays. And uh, Matthew, congratulations. Thank you very much. Well, without doubt, there's been uh, there's been a whole host of new innovations. You know, we've introduced a new um, uh, new learn to ski weeks. We've introduced um, uh, lots of areas where we've been offering lower prices. We've been offering uh, lots of places where um, where people can get uh, get better and better value. Representing the winner this year of Ferry Company of the Year, P and O Ferries, Simon Johnson. Congratulations, Simon. Thank you. It's a great accolade again. So we've won it now for three or four years running, ever since it started. Well, we've just ordered two brand new ferries. They're coming out in 2011. 300 million pounds for spending. Very exciting. They'll be there for the Olympics. So, you know, more innovation, more product coming out for people to try. Stephen, Lindsay, they are winners this year of the most environmentally responsible budget airline. Fly. BE. So, that, um, we're the world leader, or the, the first airline in the world, to introduce eco-labelling into aviation. Um, if you're familiar with the type of eco-labels you get with white goods in uh, uh, washing machines, 
tumble dryers. It's that sort of concept. Um, we actually have complete transparency when somebody actually makes a purchase decision with Flybe. They know what impact they're having on the environment.